Hi guys, as you can tell, I thought I would do another sit down video this week. I apologise that there was no video last week, but I have been very snowed under with um, a lot of dissertation work for university, so I apologise for that. But as you remember in my last video, I said that I am very proud to be British, as you can probably tell from my shirt. So this week I thought, why not do the British tag? which was started by uh, somebody, I believe, called Beauty Crush. So I will be asking 12 questions uh, about being British and giving my answers to them. So, without further ado, question one is, how many cups of tea do you drink every day and how many sugars? Well, for me, as I said already, I'm very British, so probably around four to five cups a day with no sugar. Um, yeah, just excuse me a minute. Sorry, that's just my second cup there and it's already 12 o'clock. Uh, number two, your favourite part of a roast dinner. For me, a favourite part of a roast dinner has to be the roast potatoes. Nice and crunchy and crisp on the outside and soft and yum on the inside. Just mm, yum. Definitely roast potatoes. Uh, number three, your favourite dunking biscuit. For me, it has to be the chocolate digestive. Uh, Best biscuit ever. Nice and crunchy and chocolate on the outside. Yum. Number four. Favourite British pastime. Well, my favourite pastime is actually going... Is actually going to um, the caravan. That I... So, my favourite pastime has to be going to the caravan, which you saw in the, one of the previous videos. And going down there, sighing in the sun, and going down to the beach, which you also saw in that last clip. And in that night, I love it the most, because obviously in England it rains all the fucking time. Apart from when I just said we're lying in the sun. But, you know, it rains pretty much every night after there's been sun. So that's what I love the most, being warm and cosy in the bed and inside the caravan. And you can hear all the rain on the roof because it's an old, you know, old-fashioned flat roof. So it sounds very, you know, you can hear all the rain dropping on top so I love that when you feel all warm. Uh, number five, favourite word? Well probably <laughs> No I'm kidding, of course it's not. I'm British but my favourite word is probably bloody and that sounds bad because it's kind of, well it's a swear word but it's not because it can actually be used to describe something where there's a lot of blood of course but um, no my favourite word is bloody. Um, basically cockney rhyming slang so Listing off any Cockney slang that um, we know. I've got a few written down here so I don't forget them. Because I have I had them all up here but with my memory I'm going to forget them all, the ones I had. So uh, you have apples and pears which is the stairs. Uh, Rosie Lee, cup of tea. Adam and Eve, believe. So you say, can you Adam and Eve it? Can you believe it? Uh, dog and bone, phone. Boat race, face. Ruby Mari, curry, and there's loads more, but you know, I don't know that many. Number seven, favourite sweets. Probably jelly babies or anything fizzy or jelly related. Number eight, what would my pub be called? Uh, well, my pub would probably be something typical British again, like the Queen Victoria or the Queen Elizabeth, something like that. Number nine. Sorry about that guys, my battery uh, cut out there, so I had to use my spare one. So number nine, um, the number one British person, of course, for me it has to be probably Winston Churchill. Uh, number ten, your favourite shop. To be honest, I don't really have a favourite shop. I like quite a number of places, but I think maybe something like Top Man or something like that. Uh, number eleven, the first British song that pops into your head. So, with that, um, probably anything by the Beatles, or God Save the Queen, of course, or Rule Britannia. Number 12 is Marmite. Love it or hate it? Well, actually I'm in the middle. I don't obsess over it, but then I don't hate it. Like, it's something that I do eat, I enjoy it, but I wouldn't say love. So, yeah, that concludes the British tag for this week. Uh, I hope you've enjoyed it, and if you did, then give it a big thumbs up, and if you're new around here, subscribe below, and I will catch you next week. Bye!